I'm going to do it to the opposite side of the fondant cake too. I've got the air pressure to this very low. Being a double action airbrush like this is, allows me to control the air more than a single action airbrush also. Not always necessary for everyone, but needing the uber detail that I demand, I have to be able to control that also. I'm going to put a different motif on the side. I'm trying to add as much detail as I can also, even though it's a silhouette kind of a design. It really does make a difference. Try to get a little bit of a fade to the feet. I think now we're, start, we're ready to start adding some color. And yes, we are. I'm going to start with the darkest color this time, even though I normally would start with a lighter color. Now I'm going to start adding the color to this, babe. Start with the darkest color first. I think I'll get it a little down personal on it. I think I'm going to add some pine trees. Fluff them up a little bit. Now it's going to look a little odd at first because I'm doing the trees first and then the sun and everything is going to be after this, but there will be a beautiful sunset behind this. I think what I'll do is I'm going to put trees in every corner. I like doing these cakes a lot because you only can do the general idea and everything else you just got to kind of add lib after that. So while I have the general idea of what I'm going to do, trees on the corner, motif of the horse on the sides, I still don't know exactly how I'm going to do that. I'm not going to start doing what I call Uberizing for sure the hyper hyper custom of airbrushing. Well I take design not just from the side or the top that I'm doing and over the edges and into the part of the design. Not easy to do and a little rough on the knees. I think I'll just do a diagonal little something something there. I now have an idea what I'm going to do but I'm really not going to tell you right now. for a nice little interesting cloud pattern behind these. I don't want to do too much here. That's what I meant by subtle over there. Not really hard. Not let's just hit the trees. As you can see I've added quite a bit more detail, some starbursts and some cloud effects on the design. Uh, I've got a little more richness in the design, really pumped up the color and got a nice little richness to it. Now I'm going to do the lettering, the really sweet part of any kind of design. I'm going to do black lettering, a little script style lettering here.
we're out of time and it's all set. Check us out at uberairbusexpert.com. I'm Spoonie. Take her easy.